Alright, Shalom. Before I get started, I'm going to give all praise and glory to Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh Shah, Bashem, Makaku Dash, double honors to the apostles and the elders of GMS, the ruler T. Well, for peace and safety to the arguments around the four corners of the world. Is pushing out this truth, giving all diligence to putting their lives on the line to do so. This is the brother Karas is out here with the GMS Atlanta camp. Is back here with um, a quick uh, living water, uh, spiritual hydration. You know, and um, <clears throat> I'm gonna go in on the topic of, of Jake being simple and not knowing, um, you know, the powers of, of Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shah. You know, because Jake, which are you so-called blacks? Um, Latinos and Native Americans don't um, know who the highest power is, man. You think um, Esau, which is a so-called white man, is is your god, man? That's why you um, you, you you basically obey him, you know, and every, and, and do everything that they, that they say, you know. And um, matter of fact, I'm gonna start off, you know, because really, you know, the so-called white man is, is our enemy, you know. Since the womb, you know, since Jacob and Esau was fighting in the womb, the, the white, the so-called white man has been our enemy, and Jake um, trusts in the white man, you know. Jake um, loves doing uh, uh, black on black crime, you know, robbing another brother, you know, <clears throat> robbing a, another um, is, Israelite, so to speak, you know. And and, and and they see Esau or something, they, 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 they don't bother him, man, because they fear him, you know? So I'm going to start off with, in Sirach, the 12th, 12th chapter, in the 10th verse, it says, Never trust thine enemy, for like as iron rested, so is his wickedness, man. You know, and who is our enemy? The so-called white man. You know, and Jake puts all his trust in the so-called white man and actually thinks that, that um... Our own people is our enemy, you know. Jake Jake don't doesn't believe that the white man is is, is set up to destroy them, man. You know, through what through GMOs, you know, through um the chemtrails that's being put in the air through our through like I said before the GMOs which is our food, you know, um the the air that we're breathing. You know the, uh, the the stuff that that Esau pushes out, you know, um, in in the schools that that is destroying um, Jake, man. You know, and Jake doesn't believe that that um, the so-called white man is doing this, man, because he's blind to the fact of it. You know, and um, I'm gonna get us another scripture. This is Hosea chapter four and verse six. It says, "My people." Are destroyed for lack of knowledge, and what's that knowledge? This that's the scriptures, man. You know the scriptures is that knowledge. Jake doesn't know the scriptures, man. So they're destroyed, you know. And when when they see the prophets um for them that's pushing out this truth, they don't want to hearken to it. So so therefore you they they're going to be destroyed, man. You two thirds are going to be destroyed, you know, because you don't want to hearken to the words of Yahweh by Shem Yahweh you rather just keep on living your old um, plain life, you know, being finished and and, and um and, and bow down and bowing down to Esau. Therefore, you will be destroyed, man. You can't, you won't be able to make it to the kingdom of heaven like that, man. You know, so it says, "My people are destroyed for lack of knowledge, because thou has rejected knowledge. I will also reject thee." You know, so the the Lord is going to reject you. The highest power is going to reject you because you reject the the, uh, the wisdom and, and, uh, and knowledge of the scriptures, man. You know, Isaiah 33 and 6 says, Wisdom and knowledge shall be the stability of thy times, man. You know, and Jake don't want to get it. You know, they don't want to believe that that um, wisdom and knowledge is going to be the stability of, stability of thy time. They want to believe that Esau and guns is going to be the stability, man. You know, Jay always want to uh, 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 have a gun on their hip with one clip and thinking they're going to take over the fucking world, man. It don't work like that, man. It's uh, The scriptures speak about wi wisdom on um, bare rule of everything, man. You know, wisdom is, is, is the key ingredient, man. You know, 
because through wisdom, man, you'll you'll um be able to um learn how to move, you know, learn how to, to be able to um, discern through different spirits. You know, it's a guidance. You know, it's a it, hey, um follow, wisdom is following that that straight and narrow gate, man. You know, it says, I will also reject thee, that thou shalt be no priest to me, saying thou hast forgotten the law of thy power. I will also forget thy children. You know, so, so Jake has basically forgotten the law, statutes, and commandments of, um, that the Lord was uh, set up for us, man. They don't, they don't, um, they don't, they don't listen to it, man. Jake and their in their inward parts know that that they are going off, but it's just, it's just like they got that, that that itch, man, to go off. You know, Jake um, and get a tattoo and be like. You know, Jake knows tat tattoos are off, man. You know, Jake knows that smoking is off, but they got that itch, man. You know, because they 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 um they they forgot they forgot that that, that, that those law statutes and commandments that that um in Hosea four and six is speaking about, man. You know, they 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 don't want to remember. Therefore, that you will be destroyed, man. You know, it's plain and simple, man. It's one way or the other, man. You know, the Lord, the Lord is not some type of uh, a comp complicated. Um, you do this, you do this, and then you do this. Nah, man, it's either that or that. Hey, let your your yay be yay, your let your nay be nay, man. You know. So um, let me get another scripture. This is Proverbs chapter one, um, um, and twenty two. It says, "How long, you simple ones, will ye love simplicity?" You know, and Jake is as simple as all hell, man. Jake is in, indulged in folliness, you know, in, in, in that mirthful spirit, you know, always wanting to go to a party or to the club or to a, a fucking um, a fair, a county fair, you know, always trying, Jake just always trying to be in some wickedness. You know, uh, uh, whether it be adultery or anything, man, Jake is is, is, is trying to find it, man. Instead of finding that 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 true comforter, man, which is the scriptures, the church, the scriptures is the um the true comforter, man. But Jake is, is um Jake like the, I I remember watching the brother um a rock and Thumb Yard's video. Um, Jake loves to overindulge in, in wickedness, man. You know. Jake loves that man. It says, and the scorners delight in their scorning, and fools hate knowledge. You know? <clears throat> you two thirds hate knowledge, man. You know, if 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 um someone tried to correct you, you are you already set in your in your wicked ways, so you don't want to listen to them. You know? You you don't want to listen to the, to the scriptures because you think the white man wrote it. You know, it's just you just all the way off, man. And the only way you, you up you um you're gonna be cleansed is through that fire, man. Thermal nuclear missiles, man. That's gonna be shot over here to America, man, aka Babylon. You know? Because you don't you because you love you you, you, you like some simplicity, man. You like to be simple, man, and stupid, um basically for lack um lack of better terms, man. Jake is like likes to be stupid, man. You know, and if you're in the right spirit, you know you you it'll piss you off. You know, I'm gonna get one more uh, scripture before I close out. This is Isaiah chapter chapter one and verse three. It says, "The ox knoweth his owner, and the ass his master's crib, but Israel do do not know. My people do not consider." You know, so these two plain, um, simple animals know, still know who their master or their, their owner is, but Jake doesn't, man. Who, but I, which our master is Yahweh, who you people ignorantly call um, God, and Yahweh Shah, who you people ignorantly call Jesus Christ. Those are our, our masters, man, our higher, our higher powers, man. You know, but Jake doesn't, doesn't, um, want to believe it. They they still want to believe on Jesus Christ, man. You know? Why is Jesus like um like we had we held camp today and we seen a um a, a two third nigga walk by and one of the brothers was holding up the um 
the Caesar Borgia sign and, and Jake, you know, kind of scoffed at it, man, because he think Esau is his higher power, man. You know, so you're going to be destroyed. Plain and simple. You know, it says, <clears throat> verse 4, I'm going to end off on this verse. It says, ah, simple nation, a people laden with iniquity. You know, and what's iniquity? Um, sin on top of sin, man. Jake is laden with sin on top of sin. Every, every time, everywhere that you turn around, you know, and I, I can attest, especially here in Atlanta, you know, where, where, I, where we live, man, Jake is laden with iniquity, man. You know, Jake is always going off, man. Whether it be uh, the style of clothes they wear, their, their hair, they like to dye their hair blonde. You know, they like to get tattoos, they, they like to smoke, they like to commit adultery, they like to do drugs. Atlanta is a real um, uh, um, city that's laden with iniquity, man. It says, A seed of evildoers, children, children that are corrupted, they have forsaken the Lord, they have provoked the Holy One of Israel unto anger, they are gone a away backward. You know, so so if you really think about it, why would you want to um, um, provoke the highest power to anger, man? Why would you want to do that, man? That's basically, that's like common sense, man. You know, if, if like when we were kids, you know, you never, you never really wanted to make your father angry, man. You know, you always kind of wanted to, you always wanted to obey him. You know, if, if you know, you know, at time your father get out of work, you always wanted to make sure that, that things were in place. You know, um, pursuing to your, your, like your chores. You know, like is the grass cut, is the dishes clean? You know, is the trash taken out? You always wanted to do do those things so your your father would be uh, pleased when he gets to the house, man. Hey, but but Jake does, but Jake now, man, they don't care, man. They like, hey, man, fuck it. It is what it is, man. Hey, that's what the, the Most High is going to destroy you, man. He's going to kill you. You know? Plain and simple. Because you don't want to fucking get it. You know? And I'm going to go ahead and close out. I hope that was edifying to um, let brother. You know, I'm going to close out by giving all praise and glory to Yahweh. By Hashem, Yahweh Shah. By Hashem, Kakwadash. That belongs to the Boston Elders of GMS. Until the next time, shalom.